Real life street stars, y'all put it together. We got a situation here. Man, uh, OG Giggity uh, has blessed us with a great interview, but also he wanted to come through and tell us about a new project that he has going on, which is now he's getting into reality TV. And we got a squad in front of us right here, right now. Uh, welcome to the couch. Uh, first and foremost, I want to have everybody introduce themselves because this reality show is uh, something that I don't think, uh, you know, they got baddies west and south. <laughs> they got uh, Fla- <laughs> southeast west. They got flavor, 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 love and shit. You know, all that shit, all these other reality shows. But what y'all doing is something very different, man. Y'all, y'all, y'all doing something that's uh, a lot more people, I think, can relate to. Um, life after prison, is that what we call yes. it? Yes. Uh, and this is a Terrence uh, Civilian Williams uh, <laughs> production. Right. Uh, exactly. Where he is basically putting a lot of stuff on Front Street. Yeah. Um, now you got some people here. You got some cast here. Uh, I want to have some people introduce themselves. Uh, up. To, let's start up to the left right here. Uh, introduce yourself. Tell us your role. Who, what, what's What's your role in the reality show? I am an actress. Um, the main character. My name is Latoya. First. So I am the act. I'm an actress. The main character. I am Terrence. Um, fiance. I don't know. You don't want me to see that. He just broke up with me. Oh, oh, oh. The, the drama already. Oh, my. The drama already kicks off. She's tripping. I, I, I already. Oh, shit. I held, I held him down and then he betrayed me. Oh, oh. That's, that's what we do coming from prison. <laughs> that's what happened. But we going to find out why, though. <laughs> that's what happened. That's what happened. And next we have. Okay. She's you, stuck. This is Master P have. cousin right here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's a Master P cousin. <laughs> uh, can you introduce yourself? Um, uh, my name is Kimberly, and I'm Latoya's friend on the movie, and I betrayed her for Terrence. Terrence. Oh, oh, you, you said I wasn't no good. Like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You said it's a lot of betrayal going on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And uh, to let me get, grab the mic because I know you got this is y'all in my chair, um, and just introduce yourself. You're on the couch. Yes. Um, so I am Eileen Sugar. I'm a feature. I don't have really have a part in the show, but I am a feature artist. So I'm La- Eileen Sugar. I was about to give you my government name, which is Latoya. <laughs> <laughs> um, based out of New Orleans, uh, up and coming and developing. So Tell that's just. Uh, so I do have a single out right now called Blue is Cool. Okay. And I'm currently working on my second single, which is originally my mother's song. So I'm elated oh, for that. It's going to have live instrumentation. So I'm currently working on that. Yes. We'll be able to see that on the show as far as some, um, of, your music will, some of your music will be on the show, possibly? Yes. So the my single, Blue is Cool. Oh, man. Come on. Yes. Uh, we can't wait. You can't have a good show without good music. Yes, yeah, sir. My, my lady gave me a little private party. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, so I, there's a scene. Yeah. There's a scene. She's singing and we sitting at the table. I'm giving her the sweet eye. This is my woman over here. But we, oh, man. Oh, the plot thickens before we even got play started. Up. Okay. Play up. Play okay. move. <laughs> All right. Um, in the back here. Uh, my name King. I'm uh, his uh, writer uh, from the Boys at Wall. Okay. Yeah. All right. You need to <laughs> gotta can't have a good project without a good writer. Yeah, he, he write. That's for the movie that that I'm doing the movie. Oh, that's yeah. my writer. All right, bet, bet, bet. This right, is this woman right here. You gotta let people know you're not single. Okay, you, you, you let me know. Hey, listen, <laughs> listen. Keep it in the family. That's right. Uh, let people know. My name is uh, Michael. I'm one of the cinematographers slash producer. We got another cinematographer too. He ain't here. His name uh, Texas Tech. Shout out Texas Tech, Michael. You can't have a good show without a good shooter. Uh, man, here we go. So um, I can't do myself. No, no, yeah, no. I'm about to say, here we go. The the, the main, the uh, I mean, you you wear all the hats. Yeah, uh, the writer, uh, producer, the creator, the the, the star. Uh, introduce yourself. Well, what's your roles? If if I ain't said nothing that you ain't already said. <clears throat> well, um, hi y'all. My name is Terrence. <laughs> <laughs> and Terrence, that real good parents. No. Uh, <laughs> My my guy here, King, we had started, we still doing the movie called them boys at war with me and the Cadio and why Cash Money knowing them never, never did music together. But while he's doing all the um what's called that stuff he was doing? The, the, the no the people. Oh, the casting yeah, he did all the casting call himself. Um we waiting on we need a, a bird man look alike and we need a fit we like we need two, three more people for the movie. Okay, okay, okay. But while waiting, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do a reality show. So I'm Man. already on YouTube and doing the people like, oh, you're so funny. I was like, you know what? That's cool. So um, a good friend of mine, like a brother to me from uh, Florida, I reached out to his wife and I was like, because Toya have a big following on Instagram. She's trying to be a little coy right now. 
So, but she have a very big fire on Instagram. She braids hair. She got a lot of stuff going on. So I reached. I was like, "You think Toya, uh, I want to be in the reality show? I want to get uh, females that I was comfortable with, that I could start out with." So um, they was like, "Yeah, reach out to us." So I reached out. She was like, "Yeah." So we heard that. Start talking. I was like, "You got somebody else that you comfortable with?" That pe-? she was like, "Yeah, I got my best friend, and she's hyped. She did this." So like, "All right, cool." So. Um, we put it all together. Like, how long we did? Like, well, two weeks we talked? A week? About a, a week. week? About a week. About a yeah, week. Oh, wow. Yeah. Get right to it. Come down. Yeah, I, I, I didn't want to play. So um, they come down and we just put some stuff together and we, we like, we, the pilot is finished. We filmed, we started, they got here Thursday. We, st- we started filming Friday and we filmed half the day because we had to be here. We, had to, we couldn't miss this moment. Yeah, so I really but um, so far, um, we doing a reality show, but I did a little script part in it to get a little entertainment going first. Yeah, you gotta have people it. going, you know. And uh, what we did, we basically what we did was she wrote, wrote for me through my bid and her best friend, husband. They had a little situation where she don't have nowhere to go, so they <laughs> no. thinking they coming to New Orleans to live in this big old house that Birdman them and Cash Money got for me. But when they get there, it's a little shack, and her and I arguing about living in this shack. Um, then she tried to seduce me once she see the little the, the gifts I got for my girl. We got and, and then now she wanna break up with me because she tell me I'm being disrespectful. <laughs> I'm acting for a threesome. I mean, I just come out of prison. How you bring a beautiful woman in our home and you ain't gonna expect me to want to cheat? <laughs> but now she giving me some keep, oh I ain't gonna do that, and all this old you know how the women do. But um, yeah, it's pretty that, it's that is a, good. That is a dope premise. Um, how much is that pulled from real life? Oh, uh, well, <laughs> it's a reality show, so um, we just, we, we really, we just going for it, we just doing, we going, and we just being ourselves, and it's, let me tell you what's scary, because when Toya and I go one-on-one, we talk, she's so far and good into a role in her character, I'd be like, whoa, I know we be playing now, <laughs> it's reality, you know what I'm saying? And then, and then when Kimberly, when Kim get in her role, she got that, she bring that jazz and that spice. But I didn't want to do like a lot of reality shows, like she caught us cheating, so she taking the, 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 the grown woman approach, like, you know what, it's not cool, I'm not, I'm gonna still help you get adjusted to society. Because it's based, it's, I was gonna go with uh, life after, after the feds, life after the feds, but I didn't want to be stuck in the box. Cause I was like, okay, it's now it's life at the prison, Dallas. So then we're gonna go life at the prison, Florida, or Polk County, where they from, and then start. Cause I want to do other people that's coming from prison, but showing, in spite the eyes, they're being successful with what they're doing. Cause in in the reality show, I'm gonna go to how I come home and how I was able to conquer the YouTube world and how I became successful in that, just to show people like, once you get get over that, you not gonna get the materialistic things right away when you come home, uh, take your time. You know, I remember going to a house where I didn't have no furniture. I, first thing I bought, I got a sleeping bag and took my pants and used for a pillow. Then I went to Renaissance and I got the washer the dryer and the refrigerator. Then I got a bed. I still got the 32 inch TV. When I first come home, I ain't know how to work it. They had all them apps on so I just cut it off. Or oh, then I learned how to go on YouTube on it. But I still have that TV to this day. So I just want to show some. I don't. I don't want all the drama with the girls fighting and all this old stuff. But I want. It's gonna be messy. Gonna have a list, of, but it's not gonna be with all the wow. But they throwing off the mic. I don't want to be on the show no more. Yeah. So we are gonna have some fun. We are gonna be traveling. Like we were supposed to go ride the bikes. He came up with that idea to ride through that. He came up with that, but we didn't do that because we all over the place. We just film. We doing this. We running and gunning. Y'all ladies not ride bikes. Like when last yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, of course. I said some people ain't rode a bike in a while. This is good. You want to ride? Oh, school. Yeah. That's both oh. shit. <laughs> I wanted to go bowling. We was gonna go play bowling. Uh, I had ride the go call. So we got different things that we want to show people that you know it's a family. Cause we gonna be a family eventually. They bucking right now, but we gonna be a family. The three of us gonna be a family eventually. But they right now they both against me. They didn't had a girl talk today. Today was girl talk. Girl, I ain't gonna do that. Now let me show you this. She give me a seventy five thousand dollar check. I tell her at the jacuzzi, hey. I want to invest in your dream. I want to help you out. No, I don't want to do that. I know my work. She's going to run and tell her the money she gave. I said, that's my money now. I do what I want with my money. I put in the bank. It's their money. So it's everybody's money. I want to help her out. I don't want your money. Well, you're going to get out the house soon. I'm going to be ready to kick out. You know what men do. When a woman don't want to party, they go to their lady. Look, she needs to go. 
<laughs> so I'm gonna come with that. What am I gonna do? Yeah, we gotta put that in the script. We hold on, hold on. We don't, we're not gonna give them too much. All right. Yeah, we're not gonna give them too much. But All right. so let's start with your characters. Have you ever have y'all ever done any acting before? No, not at all. How was it trying to get into these roles? What was that like? Was it easy? Was it hard? Tell us about that process. Um, when he asked me, I just said yeah, and then I came here. I thought I was gonna be nervous, but I just did it. It just came easy. I didn't have a problem. Kim? I wasn't prepared. <laughs> uh, for the toxic part I was, but to keep changing the clothes, I really wasn't. And then I don't pick up a little bit of weight. So, you know, you think you're fitting certain stuff when you get here, because you're gorgeous. rushing. You are gorgeous. So, you know how that goes. We go to Goodwill, get us some stuff. Uh-uh, nah. <laughs> 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 not, not with that big YSL bag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a reality. Yeah. It's a reality show. Right, so we can go get us some outfits over there, switch it up. So, fellas, you know, as the writer and the film, how do you think they're doing? I think they're doing dope so far. I think they're doing pretty good. I think they're doing pretty good so far. How hard is it keeping up with continuity? Right, right. Same scene. Don't move the two pace. We actually been doing pretty good on no. that. You know I mean? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> I, I, I think we he could win. Win. Listen, listen. Okay. We we rolling, but they driving crazy. I, we'll knock it out. Okay, let's do another take. Okay, get this angle. Okay, come back. We like, and then here's this is what they do now. This is what they do us. We'll be dialogue, we'll be talking, right? We going, we going. And I'm like, when y'all gonna say cut? But sometimes, I guess when it's boring to them, they cut right away. But when we flooring, didn't know what they'll tell us. Once we been talk, when y'all, man, y'all was talking too long on this point, why? I said, well, y'all was engrossed in the conversation. Y'all didn't tell us to cut. So, like, <laughs> They driving me crazy with that part, but they was like, well, welcome to TV. It's like, okay, we gotta get it going because he used to film it. Oh, and I just I just show up and show out. But um, for the ladies, I was like, because I, it's like a family already, and I was like, I'm not gonna put y'all in a situation where you're gonna be embarrassed or, or disrespect. And like she liked to work out, so I was like, okay, we're gonna, I'm gonna put you in your comfort zone. We're gonna do the workout. I'm gonna, we're gonna work out on we're gonna get, you know, we're gonna. You gonna work out? Yeah, I'm gonna try. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Terrence. Yeah. I'm gonna try, baby. What, what what type of workout you gonna make him do? Some strength tra- training. Oh, oh damn. Okay. All right. All right. She eat fruits and all of those stuff. She don't eat no meat. Ah oh, man. Fruits. Okay. Fruit. You said fruits and all of those stuff. Like what do you yeah, mean? <laughs> She, she, she don't even know that shit to kill you. Right. Yeah. <laughs> but the fruit will kill you too. Like the they might be spiking the fruit, you never know. Wow. Too much anything, you know? I'm going to eat that. Old deal of a fruit. <laughs> I'm going to eat that than half of a cake. Because you ate half of a cake today. And she ate the rest. Oh, half. Damn, damn. Half tell of a cake. Tell you cool. so, so let me ask y'all ladies then, uh, you know, OG Giggity, he has a big name out here. And, uh, Expectations is you know gonna be there. What are y'all gonna do with the fame that that this may bring? Hold on, let's start here. Did y'all know who he was at first? I did. Not her. She still don't know. She still be like, <laughs> she still be asking questions. Like, you, uh, you, you, you sat through a little bit of an interview that we did. Did you, you learn some new things just in this interview? No, she was in her phone. No, <laughs> no I wasn't in my phone. I, I was paying attention, but I, a lot of things I did learn about him like yesterday. And I was like, is that really you? Did you really do that? You know, like, yeah. So I'm she like, like man, what's I'm the good. most shocking thing that y'all heard that he did? The gangster everybody. part. The gangster. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know civilian Williams. <laughs> the gangster Williams. <laughs> Uh, and that's his own moniker, man. That's kind of what he's about, man. God damn. Yeah, my brother told me, so I'm like, what? So, so with that being said, the fame, if it does come after this project gets out into the world, it will come. Um, right. yeah, when it comes, uh, do y'all see yourselves doing like a, uh, you know, New York? What's her name? Love, love, love and hip hop, New York. Uh, we already yeah, discussed that. Oh, y'all discussed. These two, yeah, that, head, together. Oh man, we already tried to put. Yeah, I'm together. saying it, it could be like yeah. a, a whole situation where y'all like we could do some. Yes. even on our end, spin off. See, see, this is what I do. My thing is this: once I have something going, I want somebody else to do their thing and get your money. Oh, I'm, you know, know what I'm saying? I'm not one of the ones that want to hold a person back or okay, y'all feel more than my coming. I'm, I don't. I want to own this. No, do your thing. I'm gonna help out. Y'all want Let's do it. But I would love to see them two together because they, oh, they got an interesting story. She'd have been in jail before. Really? Wait, wait, oh shit. Uh, <laughs> well, I yeah. uh, Kim. 
what the hell? Uh, uh, <laughs> you know, uh, was that a while back? Was that some recent? Uh, oh no, um, it was like in two thousand and two. One, it's a long time ago. Okay, okay. Um, can you talk about what what it was for? Was it? Uh, it was uh stealing out of stores from a Burlington Boost, no Boost. Sykes Fifth Avenue. That was uh, my mom. S- s- I love them. Fifth Avenue. <laughs> so I gotta ask you, what are you, what, what are your thoughts when you see these young kids running out of Nordstroms and shit right now, like recently? That you feel like, hell yeah, stick it to them. <laughs> No, I don't feel like that. I just feel like, you know, you go through a life of changing. Um, I, I had no mom, no dad. So when you don't have a family, you don't have, you look for the streets to raise you. And that's what I did. So a lot of kids are looking for the streets to raise them. I ain't gonna be like, I ain't gonna lie to you. I one time went into a, a store with a trash bag. And you they start throwing, start throwing clothes at that motherfucker and walked out that bitch. <laughs> My, in my thuggish days. Oh, okay. wow. How much? What day was that? It was right. a long time ago. Oh, you can't be. Long time ago. Long time ago. Long time ago. Long time ago. But I'm curious. What, what did you, what's the most money you've had in your boosting days? Like? 5,000, 3,000, 4,000. 5, 5,000. Damn. Were you like, baby, we're on the corner? Like, hey, let me get this off. Hey, y'all want to buy this little... It's well, 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 we we was like in a posse, so get posse, okay. like a bunch of us. So we we always sold to the dope boys. So they want everything out the store. So we we just made our money. And how much time did you have to do for that? I didn't do it fourteen months, but I had a good lawyer. Okay, there you go, there you go, there you go. See, fourteen I, months, you got yeah, you got fourteen months. This is a little fourteen. Fourteen, girl. Right. So you got some real, you got some real, you got some gangsters on the. Yeah, what I'm saying. I'm, I, I gotta make sure you got no shank now. <laughs> yeah, you got some gangsters in the house tripping. Yo, have y'all um, started altering the plot a little bit as y'all start shooting? Sometimes you see things in people that come out while you're shooting. Like, oh, let's run with that. Have y'all altered anything uh, as far as when y'all shooting? Like, let's change the storyline just a little bit based on. However, y'all are moving. Yeah, because yeah. the first time I wanted to do a scene, because she got a nice body, so I wanted to do a scene with her in the bedroom. I just got out of jail. A little red light special? Yeah, taking off the clothes, <laughs> and we in the bed. I was like, uh, I don't want her to be uncomfortable. I don't want nobody. And then I want people to get the wrong idea that I'm trying to Go to be movie on Right. You know well, or maybe go to So movie we just on. changed it up, kept her clothes on. She still showed the figure, but I had to fight. Let me tell you what I had to do. Uh, with the thing, man. Yeah, y'all look. Uh, tell me what y'all think about this here. Yeah, real nice. Yeah, check this out. So her and I, we having an intimate moment at, in the jacuzzi. But she's in the jacuzzi. I bring a grape, the, the wine, and some flowers. Oh, that's right. So she in the jacuzzi, right? We talking, but it didn't go well. So she ticked me off. I storm off. Now she go off on me at the end, right? So they want to cut my, my 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 film guy, right? I say, hold up. Catch her getting out the jacuzzi with this, but the p- people want to see this stuff, right? Now I think it was good how she looked back at that. I said, no, man, y'all tripping. I, y'all, the people want to see she in the jacuzzi, so people locked in on her, but they want to see what's giving me a hard time. What am I chasing? Mm-hmm. So I had to fight with my camera guy to get the butt shot. Cameraman, can you get a rebuttal? Okay, yeah, you got it. Uh, she had a uh, rebuttal. <laughs> yeah, she had a code ending to what she had said to close it up, and you can ask him and the, uh, the sound lady. She's not here. Yeah. It was she had a cold ending, yeah. like you know you should have shut off on it. Like that was like period, yeah. and then he just wanted to put something else at the end of it. We didn't think it was good, but it was it was it was all right. It was. Can I ask you guys who like to look at women? Would you like to see a woman with a nice butt getting out of the jacuzzi, or or the woman just being now, sassy? Now see, it depends on what it serves. Cause if if it was ended off on a something that can be like. Edgy or cliffhanger. There we go. Then was no it makes more sense. It, was it was definitely, no it was definitely a cliffhanger. It's something people probably could have been repeated for years. It was like a, I think it was a classic. Bro, so a classic, yeah, but what yo, bro. yo, it was a a whole physical expression was fire. But it was a cliffhanger. Like how she did it. Like me personally, I don't think that we needed the other. But you know, Spike Lee is on the deck. Spike Williams. Yeah, Spike Williams. Okay, I like the <laughs> Spike, <laughs> Spike. I got, I got. So, you know. Cause sometimes over sexualizing a moment can sully the scene. Right, but we didn't have no all that she did. Let me tell you what she did, some old country bunking stuff. <laughs> she went to the jacuzzi with her pants and jeans on. She got in the water with the pants on, then took off her stuff. Oh well, I said, girl, what's the world going on? You got dressed in the, the water. She should have did that in the beginning. Why is that, rebuttal, rebuttal, why is that? Man. Well, I don't know. Um, I was. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I just. I don't know. I just. 
took it off in the pool. I didn't, he didn't say he was gonna get too. He really didn't say nothing. Yeah, he didn't say all that. He didn't yeah. say the Spike Williams movie. Spike Williams other than we didn't say nothing. Right, Spike? Because here's the thing. <laughs> I don't want to have her uncomfortable. Because I'm looking at him like, well, you we did agree to do the jacuzzi scenes the day before, right? So now you about to get in this, and I'm trying to put my Mac down. I'm trying to get in your bed. Now, you a beautiful woman. So the people want to know, what is OG Giggity chasing? Yes. They see the face. They, see, they hear the attitude. But they want to see the body. And I'm, what I'm, and I, you know, we all talk a different audience. I'm doing this for the fellas in jail. Yeah. Because when I was in jail, we look at Love Hip Hop, I just want to see the pool scene, the women on the beach, or oh, oh, girl, let me cheat. Yeah. So and, to, to say that, it, yes, yes, about 70% of the audience probably would wonder what's under the water. And just to show me, 70%. So there's an audience that you can it to. But as a cinematographer and a writer, like, nah, I like more in the story and the, it was a good ending. It was, like, yeah, like, yeah. sometimes you gotta go with more the artistic side of, of what you're shooting, you know? <laughs> Which brings us to creativity. How how many battles of creativity do y'all have? Yeah, those conversations of creativity. Well, see what we do, and this is why I like to work with him, especially him, is because, and even with the women, we are gonna sit down, like we'll talk, and I might be like, no, I won't do this. And then if they all against me, I'm like, all right. <laughs> like they voted me out on. So what do we, what do we, what y'all voted me out on? Uh, so I'm going to, I'm willing to learn. I'm working with everybody. So yeah, everybody. Out their own shit. <laughs> they, did they, all, they all just had a hug. Yeah. Like, no, we think we should do it. Like, all right, let's do this. this let's do it like this. <laughs> Yo, it's boy. Y'all just don't know. This fight Williams. <laughs> oh, I'm going to be a little hard because I, I know I win. I know my vision, you know? So, but you go ahead, the guys like you know the, the rated PG guy. But what I'm looking at is this: okay, we're doing a reality show. People going, they want to see OG Geek, but people want to see women. They want to see nice bodies, cute face. They want to hear the attitude. You know. Let me ask. I don't want to go down the list. You know, for all y'all who watch movies and are movie connoisseurs, um, how long do y'all feel a sex scene, a sex scene, should be in a movie? You know, boom, sex scene happens. How long should it be? Go ahead. Uh, I don't think long. I think about one minute. About one minute. No, one minute? Okay, one minute. Not too long. Uh, Ken, what would you feel with I don't think too long. They get a little too, they doing too much with it now. Like, well, we're going to do one, me and you, and we just time it. We're going to break the record. <laughs> the Guinness Book of Work. So not too long. No, it's one minute. I said less than that. That's, because okay. you know, we can get uh, 30 we're seconds. Trying to duck her, oh, we? 30. Okay, about 30, about 30. About 30. Uh, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. I, I'll say that I'll say the same thing about 30. 30 seconds just minutes. to show you that's that. That's enough. Okay. That's I enough. mean, depending on you know what kind of movie it is, too, we gotta think about that. Okay. Like uh, Fifty Shades of Grey. Let's say some love story. Not gonna expect a one minute. You know, you're gonna expect a little more. Oh, we talking about a movie. I need about five minutes because I need them to flip over. Oh, here. oh yeah, oh yeah, oh, oh, you're <laughs> yeah, you a different position, man. Yeah. <laughs> you're the silhouette, man. Yeah, man. That's that's called a worst cop. <laughs> Terrence, yeah, what I want. Terrence, I don't think he would have last thirty seconds. It don't matter. Oh. It don't matter. It don't matter. It's gonna, it's oh, gonna, 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 gonna oh, be oh, my oh, challenge. Big baller is in my house. Uh, uh, uh. Go ahead. What do you feel? I'll probably say about 10 to 15 seconds. 10 to oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, you ain't gonna get on the hall, you can take a 10 seconds. Yeah, just, <laughs> you gotta get a stiffy first. That's 10 seconds for that. Hey, man. You got the foreplay. <laughs> because sometimes it might be kids and stuff watching too. It might be little kids. Yeah, well, close your eyes. Parents. Well, close your eyes. Five minutes. Bro, when you doing a show, they gonna know if it's children ready or not. So don't somebody know the kids watching this because they know. You know you're not supposed to really get the stiffy, right? You're yeah, you're supposed to put the sock. That, oh, let me tell you about that sock bull crap. I ordered that. <laughs> Listen to me, man. I ordered it. It was a brown and a beige come, right? So I remember Wait, that girl. He ordered it? Yeah, because I, I didn't know we were, I wanted to try it yeah, out. Yeah, he's he got really good. That thing, the, he man. Got that. Yeah, so I said, I'm going to get me see what this stuff oh, is, right? Because at first I was thinking, like, okay, we're doing a reality show. He's playing as my woman, but. And these are beautiful women, and they got nice bodies. So I was like, okay. I so when you did this, bro? That's all you think about. I don't know that stuff. <laughs> like I said, if I was rudely interrupted by him, so I, when I get it, I said, "This the sock? It's like a wave cap. It's thin." Oh. I so said, I try. I said, "Man, ain't no way in the world the women not gonna feel what this sock for." Mm -hmm. 
I, I, said, I, I never knew. I never knew. Silicon. Man, it's like a little wave. It's a thin material, like a little silky thin material. I guess it's just to keep you from going inside the woman if they uh, really do so a new. Like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, because that man, I you said, me some. Yeah, um, I, I got that at the house. Now nah, ordered all that stuff from Amazon. You know, they just ended uh, the actors' strike. Uh, yeah. Because actors aren't getting paid enough. Uh, they were talking about using AI. Uh, you know, yeah, writers. Yeah, right. Yeah, the writers' strike was yeah. as well. They weren't getting paid at all for the uh, yeah. they were doing. What are y'all thoughts on that? Now that y'all coming into this world of acting and doing, do y'all feel like uh, you know uh, there should be a union to you know maybe you're working too many hours. Y'all didn't went fourteen hours on the on a on a day shoot. Like God damn it, where's the union I need to call to stop? Or are y'all just getting out the mud and saying we just trying to figure this acting shit out? They should have been at a union, yo. Know, like way back in the sixties. I don't something. agree. Mm. Cause here's my thing. People want the fame, people want the notoriety, you want to be seen. So if I'm telling you I have a role for you, but it's gonna require this because my budget fit this, we're gonna shoot this many hours. If you don't wanna do this, beat it. <laughs> Somebody else gonna wanna come along and wanna take yeah. this role. <laughs> yeah. So when people go to scream, I want to, I want to, this is a burden man with people. You know what we and even me, because when I speak by ears are the closest. We pray to God for this job. I want this job. When we get the job, I don't feel like working. I don't tell. I don't know. But I want to check. We always do that. We are pray. It's called a grandma. Grandpa, say a prayer for burning candle. I need to get this job. Please help me. Go, please give me the job. When we get the job, Be now amazing. we working. Now we don't want to work. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we get the screaming. We want help. We. All right. I tell you what. Well, you go work. Go do on somebody else's set, and I'm gonna find somebody else who's gonna want to work. Yeah. But I'm. I am also aware that people have other things to do too. Yeah. So. That's like how we did. Like we they came out here Thursday, we worked Friday, Saturday. I said, okay, we're gonna be off Sunday. And we're gonna pick up Monday and Tuesday. I love this, man. You know what I'm saying? So I love where this is going. Um, what are y'all shooting for as far as to putting out on what platforms? Well, my thing is this. Of course, I'm you know I'm going. I'm trying to get the clouds. I'm reaching yeah. for the big dogs, right? Yeah. Netflix or whoever. But if they take too long, I'm not gonna wait for them. Cause here's my thing. I know where I started you. from. You know, from YouTube, and I grind my way, and I get have some checks from there. So now what I'm gonna do is if they take too long, because I got a good cameraman, I got a good sound woman, uh, Char what is it, Charlene. Yeah, Charlene. Char oh, Charlene. before I forget, shout out to Flash and Mike. Remember Mike and Flash that came in last time? Yeah, yeah. They in the reality show too. Oh, yeah, they yeah, played yeah. the role for me. So, um, but uh, I love my trans dog, what I'm talking about? Uh, trying to put it out on, uh, oh, put it on Netflix. So, you know, YouTube is... What I'm gonna do, no, that's, that's what I'm about to say. So never take long, I'm going to Tubi, I'm going to uh, or Amazon Prime, and all these other little platforms that take that stuff, I need to make some money. So I'm not going to wait on them and just be playing them games because I got money invested in this. There you go. Is any more actors going to show up in the show? Anybody that's going to be surprised that, uh, that's coming in? Anybody else? Uh, yeah, it's, yeah. Uh, um, here's the thing. I have a good chemistry with these people here. Yeah. So... I'm going to roll with them if they comfortable or they say, okay, look, let's bring another girl or I thank you. But the show is based on what I got going on. Yeah. So I have them for the, the men entertainment, but it's really my life, what I'm doing, what I got going on. Because people be like, oh, gee, we like to hear I'll be on the truck. I'll be watching you on YouTube. Or this. Okay, well, let me go to the reality show. Let me there go make go. this stuff, make a, a, a broader audience. So I'm not really... Uh, focusing on now, it would have been big. Somebody told me, but I was like, "No, nah, I want to do it myself first. Not saying if he would have came on, but it was like, "You out here in Texas? Why you get Charles White to come on your show?" Charles White. Boy, I said that'd have been real big. Yeah, but I, but here's the thing, I wanted to do it first by myself, <clears throat> so I can let everybody know I'm not playing, and I want to build off my own name and reputation. Then I'll start reaching out to celebrities and people out here in the Dallas area. Hey, come on, you want to come on the show? I can come hang out with you, kick it. It's like I got a guy now, he gonna let me use his restaurant. Oh, okay. oh come on you now. Know, he got a restaurant yeah. off in Dallas uh, he had uh, introduced me to. Are there any scenes in Walmart at all? Well, we don't know if Walmart's gonna give us a boy, like we Walmart. Yeah, I know it's hard, it's, hard, yeah, it's hard to clean that Walmart scene, but. Yeah, you know, we might get you outside, though. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We in the Walmart parking lot. Right? Or I might get on a little, that little car. Walmart? Uh, just this corner is Walmart. Oh. Back when they used to be over 24 hours, that was the safest place you'd go to just be like, this is, yep. this is America. Yep. America. Yeah, like, I just went to Walmart. Yeah, you know, since COVID, they shut down at 24 hours, mm -hmm. right? It's since COVID, they shut it down. But back then, you go 3 a.m., go to Walmart, that was a club. That was, yeah. that was everything. Nigga, I need a plug. I need a whatever you need. It's crazy, you said it, because they got, on Instagram, they got 
girls in Walmart, they got their little beat from New Orleans that they get to dance and bounce. Yeah, I've heard a girl, a girl went viral. <laughs> Why they were? She went crazy uh, twerking by the water, man. <laughs> twerking by the, she was twerking all in Walmart. You went viral crazy. Mm. Um, so ladies, uh, Kim, Toy, I got to ask y'all, um, you know, you know, if life, uh, reality imitates life or life, imit- whatever the word is. Mm-hmm. Uh, would y'all talk to someone fresh out of prison, let's say within two months? Would y'all, a guy, hey, I just got out two months ago, would y'all talk to a guy fresh out of prison? In real life? In real life. No, not me. Uh, just cuz? No, I, because I feel like um, when they get out, they don't, they don't really be themselves. Mm. They, they, they get out, um, they think they want to be this person who they created while they was in there. But they come back out and they go back to the person that they were before they went in. So I will give it some time. I dated a guy. Um, he had been out like eight months, and he went back to the, the little boy that he was before he went. So now moving from that, you got to be out about five years. So me. she's gone. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> one time she said, "It only takes one time to know." Yeah, and, and you know what? First time, so. I take that back about her acting. I thought she was acting. That's really her in real life. Oh, from she, the, uh, she, reality. Yeah, that's, she, 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 that's she, real. She, it's really reality. I thought that was just her acting for the uh, reality show, but that's really her. Oh, they've been shooting yeah. at each other all day. Man. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so no, that's a no for me. Kim, uh, two, a guy fresh two months out. He meet. He meet. Every, he meet all criteria the way he looks. She dated the dude first day home. Her. Uh, 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 <laughs> well, I have dated two, three guys that have, but it was my ex. That was my ex. No. Oh. It was my ex. Oh, he got back out. Oh, he got out. Yeah, they did a long bed. Yeah, but no, I never dated nobody that just got out. But will you? But will I have. You know? Yeah. Will I? No. No, I wouldn't because I learned from them, even though they was my ex. But everybody not the same. Yeah, they, they be uh uh-uh. uh. They come up uh, with a whole plan, whole. I think, I think, I think all of them was I the same. If yeah. anything, just date. Yeah, just date. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, you said you date them? Uh, I just, I'm not doing that. What, well, Kimberly, you want? I ain't doing it. From this from the past, I'm not doing it. Let somebody ba- else do it. <coughs> Based on you know today's big cap. <laughs> big cap. <laughs> big cap. <laughs> Based on today's society, uh, and based on what y'all filming that reality show. What is y'all views on dating? What is the scene like? What do y'all think it's like? You know, is it being, and are y'all portraying that inside of this reality show? Not everybody at the same time. Who <laughs> um, yes, we, we, we trying to show a little um, dating, but, and, and it's good you say that because Toya got that down pat. She's a strong woman. And then realize she don't have all her different businesses that she run. So it's perfect for the reality show because she's showing like, what's your favorite thing you said? I don't want to mess it up about the table. The tape? The, the table. table. I bring a table to the table. Oh, I bring. Oh, you bring, <laughs> I don't, oh, you bring I don't, the table to the table. Oh, I don't, I don't just bring the table to the table. I bring the table, the chairs, the forks, the plates, the spoons, the cups, the everything. No, say the other stuff you say today. Yeah, yeah. So what it is that you bring? Because you broke it down. No, no, no. Table. You said the, the sport. Spiritually, the, other, the sex part. Oh, I don't just bring. Um, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Cooking, cleaning, mm-hmm. cooking, sucking. I don't just bring the bare minimum. That's the bare minimum to me. I bring healing, accountability, loyalty, respect. You know, all the everything. Yeah. I don't just bring the bare minimum. And some people don't know. Some women don't know what they bring to the table. Right. I know what I bring. Well, I used to say, when they asked me what I bring to the table, I'd be like, I am the table. Ooh, okay. I'll, yeah, I'll but when you say you are the table, what, because some people, a lot of people say I am the table, but they don't know what the table is. Like, what? Is, what's I'm the house, I'm the foundation. <laughs> I'm what you can sit and shit on. The boy got the stunner shades on his job. Okay, okay. Food. So you bring everything. Yeah, and okay. I can hold it all up. Okay, mm. okay. I'm trying to no 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 see somebody said to me, I don't really know what you mean because I some people don't know what they mean when they saying that. So yeah, it just sound good. Yeah, it just sound good. Yeah. So yeah, break it down for me. So yeah. Cause I'm just I'm lost right there because I'm just trying to figure because fast with doing this thing and I'm like, is he trying to hit on my co-host? <laughs> This stuff just went over my head because she's season, season finale. Yeah. 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 We need I'm not gonna lie to you guys. We need you on the reality show. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I put a monkey wrench on this. Okay, that's just I'm just going on now. 
it'll end in a cliffhanger. It'll end in that cliffhanger. Listen, what's good? hey man, because I got a good relationship with Real Life Street Star. <laughs> We got a camera. We got our own equipment. I know y'all got the big dog stuff, but we would be up in here. What's happening now? Hey, come on now. See, that's what I like about her, though. See, she's her own boss. So when I was like, T, look at her. All right, I'm on my way. Yeah, now, nah, like you said, she has emotion. Uh, yeah. And, uh, you know, we're going to definitely tap in. So for those that do want to see emotion, man, we're going to go down and get everybody's uh, handles and social medias because we're going to want to make sure we follow whatever y'all are doing. Uh, tell us about what you got going on uh, outside of this show itself, how to follow you. Uh, the platforms you're on. Okay, you can follow me on Facebook, Latoya Munson. Instagram, I'm Phenomenal Braider. Uh, I am a um, braid educator and a braider. And I also am um, a real estate investor. Um, I got three projects that I'm working on now. I should be done by next year. Okay. And I have a dermatitis prevention cup that I invented that's coming out, hair oil. And, and I am a health and wellness coach. You got any thoughts on DJ Envy? <clears throat> DJ Envy? Yeah, you know, he out here, uh, you know. Skin. Skin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he out here selling real estate. What is he selling? Real he out here selling real estate oh, dreams. Oh, so. okay, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> okay, uh, okay. Y'all make sure I, I do follow. renovations. I buy like old houses and I fix them up. Okay. Hey, Oak Cliff, Oak Cliff got a lot of projects you could. Um, I ain't now what happened to that lady? No, she had the trucks. She had the trucks, yeah, yeah, yeah. She going through. Yeah, she going, I ain't selling she no classes. She's going to come back through and holler at us, but yeah. Yeah, I yeah. ain't selling no classes or nothing like that. So. There you go. Yeah. Uh, Kim, for uh, those who need to follow, get at, you know, see the social media movement with, with platforms. Oh, on TikTok also. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. No, no, got, TikTok, TikTok most important. TikTok, will tell you once, and that's what my health and wellness act is like. Because um, I do juicing, I eat just mainly fruits and vegetables. So, TikTok, you'll see all that. Is it hard to do that? And how long did it take you to adjust to that? Um, I tried not, that for like a day. A day? A day. A day. Um, like, I, I, I'm, I'm doing this. <laughs> you, be, you feel real drained when <laughs> you don't eat no meat. You got to be able to control your mind and just, just let yeah, your body. Yeah, I know. Go. I'm it's a mind thing. Yeah, for the first three days, you might feel some headaches, fatigue a little bit, but you just got to fight through it. I did it um for 90 days, juicing. Straight, no processed food. I haven't eaten meat in eight years. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't eat meat at all. But um, this year I did juicing for 90 days. I drank five jars a day every two and a half hours. And I think that's that's what people miss and they don't know that. You got to eat, just like when you eat food, you got to eat every uh, like two and a half hours, small portions, not big, big, big meals. But um, I drank five jars a day, two and a half hours. So... For 90 days, 90 days straight. And I lost 36 pounds. I do a lot of working out too. So, yeah, it's not hard at all. Just for the first three days, you just gotta go, you just gotta control your mind. Yeah, yeah you can do it. Fans only. <laughs> <laughs> There's like Gangsta over here, he said he craved um, sweets, and then he don't realize, realize it's not him craving the sweets, it's the parasites in his stomach. Well, I gotta, so I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta yeah. help the people out. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta, when they call, I gotta feed the people. Yeah, yeah. 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 what she talking about. You gotta, you gotta detox. Yeah. yeah, but she got fans on the page. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them your handle. If people wanna know what you, how they can contact you on. Oh, no, you not. So, um, I'm on, my name is Kimberly Willis on Facebook. And on Instagram, on Facebook, um, I mean, on Instagram, I'm Kimberly Willis uh, under, dot underscore, and I market for a uh, attorneys and lawyers, attorneys and doctors. I meant to say, and I also I heart radio station. I have a, a radio station. Um, well, it's not my radio station, but I'm on the radio station. Um, I heart in Orlando, and um, I have coming out with a TV show. It's not like a big, big show. It's like a, a YouTube, like not YouTube, Roka, um, just all the like, the, yeah, right. yeah, stuff like that. So I'm coming out with that. And then Master P, um, yeah, yeah. we coming out with ice, ice cream trucks. Um, so, you know, like yeah. Mr. Ice Cream Truck. About that. Wait, you, you, you're part of that whole little venture right there? Yeah. 31 flavors, huh? Yeah. So, 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 so we, we come out with ice cream like trucks. Ice cream. <laughs> And so, um, so you know, and then um, that's what we, I'm coming out with. We're coming out with that. It's supposed to be in March. Uh, and basically, that's about, yeah. So that's, yeah. Ice cream truck, and then I'm coming out with a shoe line. What about the fan on the page? You don't want to tell them that? 
Excuse me? The fans the on the page, the OnlyFans page. Is fans, yeah, the OnlyFans. She don't have that. Oh, she don't have that page no more? Uh, <laughs> I see it no more. Oh, man. Uh, the plot thick is y'all go watch. The reality show gonna get real. Gonna get real, real. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so is that all your your, your TikTok? Uh, can you, your handles on Snapchat? Um, I don't watch kids be doing. T- I don't really do the TikTok, but they say the TikTok is what's in. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start on the TikTok. Definitely give it. A we can work together. See, see, see. Yeah, I'm hurt. Yeah. See, see, see. It's on now. I'm gonna start at the house. Mm-hmm. All right. Um, and for those who want some good music, who wants to just be able to buy, okay. oh, you know, tell them how to follow you, how to get to your eye streams. Or can she files. sing a little something? Yeah. Hey, something? can you get? Yeah. Can you? You got? Oh wow. Can, 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 yeah. yeah let's, let's go ahead. Uh, okay. So. To get to this part, so again, Ali Sugar, that's A L E N E, um, on Instagram. I am Ali Sugar <laughs> underscore the underscore greatest. Uh, I also have a fan page that my manager created. It's Ali Sugar underscore fan underscore page. How do you spell Ali? A L E N E. There you go. They need to know. They yeah. Need to know. Um, and then on Facebook, it's my I don't know why it's my it's my government. So Latoya White, but Ali Sugar, um, and. Yeah. Um. So blue is cool. So I sing a little bit of that. Um, yeah, blue too. I remember when my heart was singing a sleepless night, just wondering, will we ever meet? I was feeling like the void was my fate. Since the first day I laid eyes on you, I knew we were in alignment. At the right time, in the right place, he's the right sign, all in my space. Here we are. Ooh, Ooh. angelic boys. Oh, wait a minute. Hey, I, hey you want people, man? You want people? And look, and look at Slick, look at Slicker man, and he the man. He's yeah, I say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Every day in the house, you be, nobody be uh, home. Cheese over there, the cheese over there. Guys. That's my word. You be cleaning the house and get to singing. That's my word. Look at him. Look how you like. Look at that yeah. yeah. boys, goddamn it. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's go. Okay, so. <laughs> For you, uh, for those that need to follow me, oh. high skills, man, how long you been in the game? Tell them how to get uh, at you, how to see your work, how to follow your movement. I've been in the game since 2008. Um, they can find me at uh, script writer Nola. Um, I wrote his uh, TV series. I, uh, I have like nine more uh, films coming out. She in them. Um, I also own my own uh, ice cream uh, company. I also have my own potato chip company and also wine company. Hey, what's it with Louisiana and ice cream, man? Oh, oh no, uh, nobody not fuck with my ice cream. Oh shit, talk that shit. Okay, okay. Nah, right, bad, bad. Um, hey, he cook. He, 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 he cook the meal for us. Tell me. Oh, Indian shit. Oh shit. Man of many hats. Yeah, yeah. And I also uh, I also manage her and also the dude named uh, Money Mike Bull and also uh, Fifth Soul. All right, okay, okay. We're gonna, uh, you don't you, you know their Instagram handles? Can you say? Them? Oh, hers. Her. Well, you trying to say hers? Right? Yeah. Oh, mine is uh, Script Writer Nola. And you want anything else outside of Instagram? Uh, That's right. it. That's it. Yeah. Uh, last question I gotta ask you: uh, Who that gonna beat them Saints? Uh, nobody. Boom. All right, there you go. God damn it. And he sound like he's no. sincere. <laughs> <laughs> Look, shout out to the fifth ball on New Orleans. You know okay, holler the home. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Uh, Michael, uh, I'm going to tell them how to get at you, man. Uh, again, uh, the cinematographer. Uh, you know, I don't want to tell them the equipment you're using because they may just go in here and have all kind of opinions on you. We're going to tell them follow you to talk about what you're using to film this reality show. But go ahead and tell them how to follow you, though. Uh, they can follow me on Instagram. They can follow me on Instagram at uh, Swenson21. There you go. All right. IG, the only thing you want? That's, that's it. All right, yeah, man. Up, uh, all right, there you go. There you go. Uh, and, uh, and you OG? OG Giggity. For them to follow this movie, you going to build a website for this movie? What you doing? I don't know. He said, I don't know. <laughs> don't know. <laughs> Take it in one day at a time. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to see how this go. God, God damn it. That's right. Yeah. No, um, yeah, like I said, I'm just... Going with the flow, he be giving me a lot of game on stuff. 
And then bro be holding me down. So if they tell me, okay, we need a Instagram just for this. Okay, let's do it. Or we need this, okay, let's do it. So I just roll with the floor. Me, I am just here to entertain the people. There you go. Just giving them what I got going on. Spike Williams. That's yeah, right, Spike, Spike Williams. I'm in the building. Yeah, for real, gangsta um, uh, singleton. You know, I'm gonna have my nine prop. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Oh, That's cool. a good one. You know, I take that stuff and run with it. Um, but yeah, when I do my nonprofit stuff, I'm about to start doing a lot of work with that, talking to the children. So I'm going to be doing a lot of films. Man, I ain't going to lie to y'all to see y'all here doing this thing. Um, let me just be honest with y'all. Uh, when Gangster called me a while back, he says, hey, man, I'm doing a reality show. And I'm not going to lie to you. I've seen, you know, we've been doing this. What Real Life Productions is before Real Life Street Stars. And we've seen a lot of people talk about doing a reality show and don't nothing come up. They ain't ever started shooting no day one, no nothing. No. Something got in the way where they just like, yeah, it didn't happen. For him to call and say, hey, I'm gonna shoot a reality show in a couple of weeks and for y'all to talk about it in a week and then start putting it together, man, y'all did the most important thing, which is, which is put your first foot forward. Started. Started. <laughs> Whether no win, lose, fail, have it come out, that's honestly where it starts, man. And all I gotta say, man, is for y'all to trust the process. Oh, the real. No matter what, y'all just sat there and oh, oh he got some. I'm gonna play. I had I had uh put in my Instagram with uh, a little part when her and I did. Yeah, let's go. I'm gonna play it for y'all. Man, what was that, man? Huh? Man, what was that? Is this audio? Man, what this song on your Instagram? Is this audio? No, I won't tell you. I won't tell you. What you say? I won't tell you. He says, I'll hold, hold it up to that camera if you're going to show us something. Hold on. This is the part. Oh, that part. Yeah. Said, hold it up to that, up to that I, camera. I, I, that, I, that, that's your camera right there. This her right here. You can't see. He got to say that. What's up? I was eating. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I was eating. Nah, 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 nah. That hey, hey, again. I was eating. It, it looked like some. I was eating. Like some. And listen, see, he, we had the, the 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 camera like y'all have. We had all that filming, but he just took his cell phone and filmed. To give us something to show the people we ain't playing. Right. Yeah, we working. Yeah, yeah, we out here working. We ain't playing. Listen, man, again, trust the process, man. Yeah. This is something great y'all doing. We as an audience can't wait. Again, this man, he ain't lying. He didn't, he, he didn't get out. He said he just knows how to entertain the people. That's it. You obviously know what the people want. Trust him. He knows what the people want. The people trust. champ. Yeah, he, he done did this shit a few <laughs> times to see the algorithm and how that shit works. So, yeah. hey, we got it, man. Life after prison, man. The cast, the writers, the directors. Everyone's here, man. Thank y'all for coming through to sit on this couch. We can't wait to see the goddamn empty, uh, the end project. And for the, with that being big said, uh -oh. y'all are here. Oh, we gonna premiere it here, y'all. Oh, come, come. Exclusive, no, real life three stars. It's going on. It's going on. The cast, writers, directors of uh, Life After Prison, man. We gotta say it, man. You guys are some real life, life three, three stars. Star. Let's go. Yeah. 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 Shout out real ass street stars, nigga. Moolah. Hey.